find out how NAFA is driving success in automotive fleet with continuing education for 2013 and beyond. I oversee all of NAFA's educational initiatives and programs, including the CAFM, CAFS certification program, uh, as well as the annual Institute and Expo uh, taking place this year in Atlantic City, and also um, all of the other meetings and events that take place for NAFA, including uh, board of directors meetings, fleet management seminars, and any other sorts of seminars we do throughout the year. I'll be working very closely with uh, both our Education Steering Board and Education Development Committee uh, to see what ways we can improve the quality of NAFA's education to try and stay on the cutting edge of uh, fleet management um, trends and issues and uh, incorporate that into all of our educational programs. Right now I'm uh, really focusing in on uh, learning more about where we are with our educational content and uh, trying to determine what kind of feedback we've received most recently from the fleet managers who have attended the courses and just seeing how we can improve and uh, incorporate new content in those areas to see what our fleet managers really looking for today and how can we um, just improve the quality and um, really get the fleet managers what they're looking for in uh, in terms of their education and what we're doing right now. I think um, with the certification program particularly, um, continuing education is something that becomes more and more important. So we want to make sure that the education um, is consistent with what um, our learning objectives are and making sure that they all tie together so that um, for recertification purposes and those who are uh, pursuing new certification that they're getting the education that's needed um, to obtain that goal and so making sure that all of the education ties back um, to those sorts of areas. Well, I think um, it's becoming more and more of a competitive edge um, as far as obtaining that certification and recertifying because uh, that's what would help to uh, set those uh, professionals apart from their colleagues especially as um, we're getting into a more and more competitive workforce. Um, it ensures the employers that they have a full understanding of even though their specific job may not entail every aspect, that they have a full broad understanding of what um, NAPA has identified to be the core competencies for a fleet administrator. I'm just very interested in staying on top of uh, new technology and how we can um, incorporate that into our educational programs as well. Um, looking into ways that we can um, do more going beyond um, sessions like webinars. Um, those have been great for giving our members um, access to education on demand, but we want to take it a step further and look into uh, things like hybrid meetings and still adding that interactive component where you're not just sitting behind a computer screen looking at a PowerPoint presentation. So I think that's something that our members can look forward to uh, in, the, in the months ahead is NAFA will be staying on top of those trends and being the first to provide that cutting edge education.